Hi, hi, YouTube. I got another snack crate, and this one is oh no, stuck. <laughs> Yay! That is from Germany. And we got the sticker. And um, the sticker on the front isn't as cool as the pirate sticker, but it's still cool enough to go on my wall if I can get it off without ripping and so far so good and we have halfway off that's what we've got we got it halfway off and I got it and it's going right there I wish I would have done that with the other one so then I have like a whole like passport on my wall oh well so anyways <clears throat> let's get this started do, 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 do. What is that? It's got a pepper on it. Let's find it. All right. I don't speak German, so I have no idea how to say this, but Tip Frisch Ungarisch. Sounds right. Uh, it's a classic crunchy potato chip flavored with the taste of sun ripened bell peppers. You think I would have learned from the last video not to eat the really spicy thing first? But here goes. They look like Lay's. That's not bell pepper. That tastes like barbecue. Your food chemistry people need some some um, taste checks because that's barbecue. Still really good though because I love barbecue chips. But I was expecting heat and it's not spicy. Like there's a little bit of kick but no spicier than a barbecue chip. Alrighty then. What is this? I can't pronounce it, but that's what it looks like. And... Erdna... Lockin. That kind of reminds me of the fast, the fad when people went, Ermigerd! But yeah, it's a salty puff corn snack made with real peanuts. They are... Seriously, addictive. Oh, yeah, because it's like peanuts and pistachios. You don't just eat one. You got to eat them. <gasps> they feel like Cheetos, but like not Cheetos. And they look like peanuts. Mm, it tastes like peanut butter. Oh, no, dip. It's made of peanuts. But it's a Cheeto. That's peanut butter flavored. That's actually really different, and I like these because I love peanut butter. Mmm. Alright. This looks like it's going to make a mess. It's called... It's not what it's called. Where is it? Do... Frigo Snooper Pufferies. Colorful fruit flavored bites made from rice and corn are sweet with just a hint of sour in every bite. Sweet and sour puffs. Got it. If I can open them. Oh, hooray! Things from Germany are a lot easier to open than other countries. Yo, they taste like tricks. But, like, they're, they're like tricks with, um, like the Sour Patch Kids cereal combined. And if you haven't tried the Sour Patch cereal, I got it from Walmart and it's really good. Mm. The only downside is you can't close it without something. And I don't know if I have the something to close it with. So we're just gonna put this in, and it's not there anymore. We're gonna put this in my coffee cup and hope for the best. 
knickknacks, knickknacks barbecue, crunchy peanuts that are coated in a zesty barbecue flavor, a German flavor that you can't put down. All right, let's see if your barbecue tastes like barbecue because you done fucked up with the red bell pepper. I got it. I got it. It's a proof. Oh, God, that is barbecue. So at least you know exactly what barbecue tastes like. Why is this? Mm. It tastes like um Tennessee whiskey barbecue, like the Jack Daniel barbecue, and it's a little bit spicier than the bell pepper, which is really ironic. I don't have to worry about that spilling over. Mm. Nappers. That's probably not how you say it. But that's how I'm saying it. If you're offended, oh well. And there, crispy hazelnut wafer cookies filled with delicate nougat and sweet milk cream. I like how they say sweet milk cream instead of sweetened condensed milk. It's like it's basically the same thing. At least I think it is. Mmm. I like how in every country they have like a candy like this. It's really nice. It's like, ooh, and theirs tend to be a little bit more sweeter, a little bit sweeter than ours. Ours are really good, though. Bueno. It doesn't sound like it should be from Germany, but it is. And these are Kinder Buenos. Layers of delicious crispy wafer filled with a rich hazelnut cream and coated in milk chocolate. Europe really likes... Oh, they're individually wrapped. Oh my goodness. And there's like, you can break them in half. Like these are, these are a candy to share. They are made for sharing whether or not you want to. Well, that's why I know how it crushed. Mm, it's like a Butterfinger, but with Nutella. So it's a little bit more crumbly, but it's really good. Maybe you don't want to share these because that's some, um, that's like really good. <laughs> Corny Big, a German twist on your favorite cereal bar. Roasted wheat, roasted whole wheat flakes and cereal crisps doused in rich milk chocolate. Sounds almost like a Kudos bar, if you remember Kudos from like 2001, 2002, maybe 2003, 4. And I was wrong. It's like a chewy bar. It's like a chewy bar. With chocolate on the other side. Mm. Oh, and they gave me two of them. That's cool. Are they, are they different flavors? Of course not. That's still pretty cool. Marmar Kuchen. A delicious combination of sweet vanilla and chocolate cake. Mixed together in a delightful, delightful marble pattern. And... Yeah. It looks like a snowball almost, but like covered in chocolate. It's like a Twinkie. Mm -hmm. mm. You know what it tastes like? It's like a vanilla flavored hostess. Douse in chocolate without the cream inside. It's still really good though. Why do snacks have to be better in other countries? Probably because I can't get them all the time. Okay. Haribo. Haribo. Volcano fizz. Volcano shaped fruit gummies that erupt with sour lava. This is the Haribo, we all been waiting for it. Why wasn't this candy in Hawaii? They actually have, like, volcanoes. I don't know of any volcano that's in Germany. Not that they don't exist, I just don't know of any. So they look like this. They almost look like the little frogs or the whales you can get from the candy store. But they're volcano, and you bite. 
It's like a gusher inside. Not bad. Mmm. It tastes like marshmallow fluff. Well, really get the sour until that last swallow there. That's like, oh, okay. Then we got these little things that look like a cough drop. But they're not. And they're called a whole day brows bonbons. Delicious and fruity hard candies with a sparkling bubbly powder hidden inside to give your tongue a sweet surprise. Kind of afraid because the last time there was a sweet surprise in the middle, it turned out to not be a sweet surprise. I'm wondering if it's going to taste like champagne. Okay. It's lemon flavor. It's good. It is good. Mmm. I mean, that is a sweet surprise. It's like lemon fizzy powder. It's pretty good. See? You can even fit, see it fizzing. So, I have something called Lock Gummy Minis. They're fruit gummies in any array of delicious flavors. Create funny faces from the different shapes. If I can get them open, that is. Woo! I think that's a nose. I'm not sure. Ear or another nose? I don't know. How about some eyes? Uh, do I all have noses? Or maybe they're like, oh, I get it. It's like, like a jack o' lantern. Okay, okay. With like a little leafy. And is this a stem? Nope, it's another nose. Here's a mouth, I think. I don't know. And. Ta da! There's my face. And now we're gonna try them. They're like fruit snacks. They're pretty good. I tell you, they're more like the fruit snacks I don't like. Um, if you know your fruit snacks, I like the ones like the consistency, like the Scooby Doo ones that are solid and you can't see through. A lot more than these. Actually, as a kid, I wouldn't eat anything like this. <laughs> but yeah. So, and they gave me two of those. And then. Last but not least, we've got the drink. I don't know why they do it this way, but it's upside down. And it, this is Schwip Schwap. It's an orange cola. I wonder if it's going to be similar to the orange vanilla Coke that just came out earlier in the year. And... Um, Yeah, they just orange coke without the vanilla. Like you get one of those machines and you hit orange. It tastes pretty good. Don't know why everything is like orange or citrus flavored when it comes to candies. I mean, it's an easy flavor to go to. But it's really good. And I'm, I'm kind of glad that it's different than the lemon lime because I was kind of getting sick of lemon lime things. And the fact that this has caffeine in it is very good. And that concludes my video. So, hope you liked it. See you later.